The New Impressive Discovery of China on the Moon Welcome to this new documentary, if it is the first time, I introduce myself, I am the engineer Hidakel Morrison and I appreciate you decide to see this educational content. In this installment we will see the progress of China on the moon, we will tell you why colonization is approaching and the start of space mining on lunar soil, with new revealing data and information on how Chinese aerospace technology continues to conquer the moon. Join me until the end of this video, thanks to applied technology, in this new educational adventure. From the perspective, of an engineer. Let's start. Our moon, that rocky place with craters, which is about a quarter of the size of our planet Earth and which is located at an average distance of about 384,400 kilometers, is the first place outside planet Earth where it is already planned to establish the first base of operation and the first place where space mining worked, since the moon is without a doubt the closest planetary body, so close that the moon can be seen with the naked eye most nights as it traces its 27-day orbit around our planet. Thanks to multiple space study and observation missions, loaded with the most varied and advanced technologies, we know that the moon is covered by craters, as well as by dust and debris from comets, asteroids and meteorite impacts. Thanks to science and applied technology we know that the moon has almost no atmosphere and only about a sixth of the gravity of Earth. We even know that there is quite a bit of frozen water hiding in craters near the moon's poles. And thanks to the contributions and advances of China, which managed to send a robotic mission to the moon, take a sample of lunar soil, bring it to our planet Earth and analyze it, a new and revolutionary discovery of China on the moon has just been made, precisely in the so-called dark side of the moon. As we explained below. But first, I ask you to support us by liking this video, sharing this video with your contacts, and subscribing to this channel, turning on notifications, so with your support, we can continue to frequently generate interesting documentaries on aerospace technology. And the universe, thank you for contributing to the creation of educational content. The moon is the only other planetary body that humans have visited. The mission with which China has just made a new great discovery and revolutionary discovery is called Change 5, a major robotic lunar exploration mission that landed on the moon on December 1, 2020, becoming China's first sample return mission, that successfully returned to planet Earth with at least 2 kilograms of soil and lunar rock samples on December 16, 2020. A feat that had not been achieved for more than 45 years, making China the third country to return moon samples, after the United States and the Soviet Union. Achievements of a true aerospace power. After analyzing and studying the lunar samples in detail, a renowned team of scientists from the Beijing Research Institute of Uranium Geology have announced the discovery of a new mineral that has been celebrated and widely publicized by the Chinese media and welcomed with recognition by the scientific community around the world. In the statement it is reported that traces of this new mineral were found, explaining that they found a piece of 10 by 7 by 4 microns, finer than a human hair, which confirmed the mineral nature of this substance, realizing that it was a totally unknown mineral, therefore that this new discovery from China is a new discovery, a new mineral that has been named Change Site Y. The name is derived from the Chinese deity associated with the moon, Change, which also gives its name to the probes of China's lunar exploration program. This new mineral is a transparent, colorless, column-shaped crystal. Minerals are a natural resource of great importance for the economy of a country, many commercial products are minerals, or are obtained from a mineral. That is why the discovery of this new mineral could have potential technological applications that give rise to revolutionary innovations, so its potential use and application in multiple fields ranging from medicine, electronics, shipbuilding, devices, etc. must now be studied. Lunar resources have generated a lot of interest from China, the United States and Russia due to their importance in the use of these resources in situ for a future lunar base, as well as being one of the keys to space exploration in the future. Also because this type of mineral and many others will be part of the multi-million dollar space mining business that is attracting more and more attention, both from space agencies and their governments and from the private business sector. Mr. Dong Bei Tong, Vice Chairman of the China Atomic Energy Authority, explained that Change Site was a phosphate mineral in a columnar crystal. The Change 5 mission involves the Chinese Academy of Sciences and the country's ministries of education and natural resources. 
Through this discovery, they have become the third power in the world to identify an unknown mineral on the moon. Russia and the United States did it before. The Chinese Lunar Exploration Program was named Change in honor of a Chinese legend that speaks of a goddess with that name who lives on the moon. The mission began in 2007, with the launch of a first probe, and in January 2019, they managed to reach the so-called hidden face or dark face of the moon, something that no one had done so far. In other words, China managed to reach a place on the moon that no one had reached and from that place, from that hidden face or dark face, they managed to bring lunar soil to Earth where they identified this new discovery of China on the moon. It is opportune to clarify that the moon does not shine with its own light. It simply reflects the light coming from the sun and also the moon rotates on its own axis at the same rate as it orbits around the Earth. That means we always see the same side of the moon from our position on Earth. The side we don't see receives the same amount of light, so a more accurate name for that part of the moon is far side or hidden side. It is not correct to call it the dark side because it has the same level of solar illumination as the dark side. What we see Undoubtedly, there are still many unanswered questions about the moon. And the most exciting days of lunar activity may yet be ahead when the next humans arrive on the moon. The first lunar base in human history is established and from the moon, sooner or later the first human will arrive. To the planet Mars. What do you think of these interesting and revolutionary findings? I read them in the comments of this documentary. Remember that I always read them.
As usual, we appreciate you informing us. It is a real pleasure to be able to provide you with the main news, trends and developments, about the most important aspects of aerospace technology and the universe, from the perspective of an engineer. I am the engineer Hitakel Morrison and I invite you to meet again in a future installment.